Hi, I'm Matt with Meat Church. Let's do a Meat Church take on the viral Smashburger tacos. Well, I'm sure you guys have seen these all over the internet, all over Instagram, TikTok, whatever the case may be. We've actually never made them. But if I'm gonna make a burger like somebody else that I see on the internet, I'm gonna step it up a notch. We're gonna make one today with ground brisket and we're gonna make a delicious sauce to go on top of it. And I'm sure it's not gonna suck, but let's just jump in to this simple recipe. What I like to do is basically create my perfect grind, which is 80% beef, 20% fat. I'm not gonna weigh it, I'm just gonna eyeball it. Uh, so first things first, I'm just gonna trim off uh, the little oxidized portion of the brisket here, because I don't like that. And then I'm just gonna trim it up into strips. And like I said, kind of try to eyeball an 80-20 uh, percentage that I'm gonna throw in my grinder over here. So let me get some of this cut up and we'll get to grinding. All right, I've got it all cubed up, nice little chunks. Um, I've taken you know, a bunch of excess fat over here. When you're done, if it looks too red, you don't think it's enough fat, you could obviously run some of this back through. Uh, today, I'm using uh, a 0.5 grinder from Meet Your Maker. You guys know that I have used this stuff for years and years and years, but super excited that now you can get this stuff at your local Academy Sports and Outdoors. So it's like, I would describe it as like commercial grade equipment, but for the home user. So when you get real serious like I am, this stuff is awesome. But let's jump in. We're gonna grind it twice, by the way. I've got the coarse plate in. I'm gonna run this meat through, and then I'm gonna change out the plate for the more fine plate since we're doing hamburgers. If I was doing chili, I would just do this. Uh, so we'll grind twice, and then we will get into making sauce. All right, it's ground up. We're gonna remove uh, the plate, change it out, grind it again. Satisfying, Ava would say. All right, well that was super easy. Looks good to me. Uh, by the way, if you watched our butter burgers recipe a few weeks ago, I wouldn't be mad if you shredded a little frozen butter in there. But you can see that looks beautiful, way better than anything you can buy in the store. It's a lot more satisfying when you do it yourself. So now we're gonna form little one inch balls basically. I'm gonna roll these up and then we're gonna jump into making a delicious burger sauce. All right, let's make a delicious sauce uh, for this smash burger taco. Never can, can decide, uh, do I want mayonnaise, mustard, or uh, ketchup? Well, we're gonna go all three. Recipes always down in the description, always on meatchurch.com. Here's a pro tip, a little Worcestershire sauce, and if you're smart, you use the W sauce because delicious. Season up, a little bit of Texas sugar, how much, however much you want, just to taste. And then we're gonna do onions, and we see people do pickles. We're gonna do pickled jalapenos. Pickled jalapenos are, you know, not, not hot. Uh, it, they're just kind of like enough to let you know they're there, give you the great jalapeno flavor, but not be what I would consider spicy. Jalapenos. All right, 
in we go. All right, I'm just gonna give this a stir, get it incorporated. Then we're gonna get our burgers out here and on to the flat top. We've got a Traeger Flat Rock griddle here fired up. It's on uh, medium heat, as you can see even the smoke, it's nice and warm. I've already oiled it uh, so the patties don't stick. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna drop down one of our patties. We are going to season it. We're going a little Mexican flair today with our Dia de la Fajita. A little light seasoning. Then I'm gonna top it with uh, fresh tortillas that I just cooked right before this. We're gonna smash it down, flip it over, put some cheese on it till it's super melty, and then go build these smash burger tacos. A little more seasoning, cheese. Check them out, looks delicious. Looks so good that I'm gonna have to make a few more of these. So I'm gonna throw this on the block and then I'm gonna cook some more. All right, looks awesome. Let's give this a shot first, a little drink. All right, we're gonna do uh, we're going kind of taco style here. Well, lettuce, tomatoes, and our sauce. Which this sauce is awesome, by the way. Gotta have this. All right. Here we go. As my man Three Pieces of Pecan would say, that's damn good. That is really, really freaking good. I don't like to jump on uh, social media trends, but I wish I would have done that sooner. That is, uh, that's amazing. Y'all gotta make that. Uh, like, I'm just gonna, hey, this stuff's drooling, down my, dripping down my arm. I'm gonna keep eating this, so let's be quick. Like and subscribe, we'll see y'all next week.